sick in the world. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing in return. Her body counting who she fucking never my concern. I'm trying to find my neighbor house. She could rob my face. I don't want nothing in return. Except for some of her time and all her love. That's my concern. I'm trying to buy my neighbor house and turn it to a y'all. If you don't know my <laughs> I'm trying to buy my neighbor house and turn it to a y'all. If you don't know my grandma name, then we ain't really dogs. Say where I can stick ya. This is the tanning fit that we love. Like I should do a little bit of explaining about focus, what competition I'm at, why I'm here, what events I'm competing in. So I'm just gonna sit you guys down and we're gonna do that. Anyway, so we are here for the World Championships. It's the major meet of the season. This is the only one that counts, really. At the Hilton Hotel, which honestly, it is so nice. We never normally stay at accommodations like this. But I bought this shirt from Uniqlo the other day. I'm gonna freak out. Look how cute that is. It's like... They're doing, so basically Uniqlo is collabing with the World Championships to do the merch and that, I don't know, I thought it was so cute. So I'm doing one meter individual, three meter synchro with Brit and three meter individual as well. I've never done all three before. I haven't competed three meter synchro on the world stage in, I don't think ever. So I need everyone to keep your fingers and toes crossed and I will keep you updated as competitions go on. Camera wars. It's like, you know when Cole Sprouse does the camera wars? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hold up. Yeah. Oh. Hey. It is time to get ready. It's currently 10.08. And I'm leaving for the pool for my competitions at 12 p.m. I qualified for the World Championships one minute final. Yay! I, now, this isn't actually my first year I've qualified for this. This is my, or will be my third World Championships one minute final. I'm so excited because even though it's my third one and I've done this a couple of times, it's actually quite difficult to qualify into the final because there's no semi final straight from. I think we had like 48 people in the prelim yesterday, down to 12. Um, there were some incredible divers yesterday who I know are just such good athletes and they're such good divers and they missed out on the final from just missing maybe like one out of their five dives. I always feel so grateful when I do qualify through to a final, regardless of what event it is. My skin has been like frying off in this chlorine. I don't know if it's because Sometimes when you go away for these really big events, they pump up the level of chlorine in the pool just because there's so many people jumping in and out of it. But like, obviously you want to make sure there's no bacteria and germs for everyone. But I've had to moisturize my body, I reckon like three times a day. It's like burning my skin. My Frank Body Moisturizer. I have one of the simpler lists in the program, so I do have to do my dives really well. So you gotta wear your sunscreen here and it's don't really reapply here, which is really bad of me, but like when you're in the chlorine, there's no point. So I just put it on. It'll be on my face for like half the day at least. I'm protecting my skin as much as I can. And then it's all washing off in the chlorine anyway. But I put about that much on. I'm going to mix it with my e.l.f. Halo Glow. One come for me because I know that you're not meant to mix your products with your sunscreen. This is the Too Faced Hangover Primer. Um, and that's actually a question we get asked all the time. Like, do you wear makeup when you compete? And I definitely do wear a little bit of makeup when we're competing at like Commonwealth Games um, and events like that that are televised and you normally do media straight away so you don't have a chance after you finish your competing to go and have a shower and do your makeup like you get taken straight from your last dive straight over to the media station so you obviously want to be looking good yeah she's at training 
Okay, and that is all we're doing for the face today. I will see you at the pool. So the last thing I'm gonna do before I head to the pool is the Normatec booties. I don't know if anyone's seen these, but they're basically like these big marshmallow compression boots and they squeeze your muscles and relax, squeeze and relax. I'll take any little one percenter that might be able to help me compete better, so. Is pump time. I'm nervous. Diving update. So Britt and I, so Britt and I competed in the three meter synchro preliminary this morning, and we did really well. We qualified in eighth position. We were ranked fourth going into the last round, but I made a silly mistake and messed it up. So pretty much, um, one, two, three did have a little bit of a, I guess, a gap in points ahead of that, but. From team four down to eight, it was one point different between us all. So I'm feeling really confident that we can do a good result this afternoon. I know that there's a lot of lift, like we can perform better than we did this morning. So I'm so excited, really proud of us that we pulled it together. And it has been really comforting for me to show that you don't need, you know, or this is the first time I felt like I can really rely on past experience to provide a good performance. And... Basically, I'm just so excited for the final this afternoon and everyone keep your fingers crossed for us.